button magnificent people welcome back to the channel welcome to another video before we go any further please like share comment and subscribe turn your post notification on so you'll never miss an upload today's special guest is none other than my best friend everybody's posting him on the channel already long time Round, I got rounds of applause. So, this is Rollin, and he will be joining me on today's video. In today's video, where we will be speaking on what individuals expect from a relationship. I don't know how many points we will have, but we will just work with the flow. And I do, yeah, we'll see that. Um, we're gonna have to pause, guys, and get back to y'all. Might as well. All right. All right. So, um, I'll start with Rollin. I'll let him start no, on what. No. All right. I'll start on um some of the don'ts. So me talk and you talk and sure. All right. So one of the don'ts for me are don't analyze. Say so don't in a relationship when you're actually in a relationship. When you look somebody else. Alright. Uh, one of my don'ts kind of actually go deeper than yours. Alright. Uh, one of my don'ts is like, don't ever try, like, take away, you know, from a man. Like, you know, in terms of if he's trying to do something, allow him the chance to do that, right? And um, you can. Alright, guys, so we're back at it again. Like, Facebook era, we had to relocate because it started to rain. Alright. All right, so the second point now that I was thinking about is not trying to change your partner from the way that you meet them. So let me explain. For example, you meet me at the party, right? Two toes as we get involved, boom, you want to change that. You want me to, not even say go to church, you want me to just hold up myself or you want me to change whatever it is that I am doing or you make me doing, I don't like that. That's a don't for me. Um, it's kind of funny that you said that because I was also about to say that too. You know, you don't want to, I have to stress this point because you don't want to try to change your partner in a real life. You know, if you meet them and do a certain thing, you should know what level of um, tolerance you have for that particular thing. Agreed. Before taking the relationship serious. You know, not when you get into the relationship now, you're going to say to the person, you know, I don't like how you do that and would appreciate if you stop that. That's going to bring contention and that's going to bring drift in the relationship yeah, as well yeah i agree you know and um with that said let me add the additional point now uh you wonder if they want your way probably they're not but you know we speak loud enough yeah, hopefully we're not here. <laughs> <laughs> all right so that brings us to the next point like if it is that you guys set out a particular goal right um you don't want to try to change your partner's goal based on your personal goals okay. i mean if you have personal goals that's fine mm -hmm. right but you should always remember that you know you have an you have a, a partnership goal as well so mm -hmm. you guys can still work towards that partnership goal not forgetting about that but you can also still work on your personal goals everybody should have that opportunity to work on themselves personally yeah and as you said that i think that um we should try to be not changing ourselves but try to be better individuals for ourselves and for our partners and with this said um relationship is not a prison sentence it's a partnership where you have to compromise right. so the next point for me is you have to compromise for example um your significant other who is a male in like watch football you can't just come and want to like have football when a man watch your football. If, as a woman, if I like to hang out with my friends, I don't think the man should be insecure. Right. Um, thinking that every time I hang out with my friends, I'm going to hang out with man or whatever. So, compromising is one very important factor. It is a do in the relationship and it's for the best of the partnership. Alright. Um... Another important thing, you know, you, you want to try to find out more about your partner's love language. With that being said, there's a very good book. It's called Five Long Love Languages. I've read that book, right? It helps you to compartmentalize how you deal with a particular partner, 
right? You have to try to know your partner. That's not going to happen overnight, by the way, right? It's going to happen over time. So you have to try different things. You have to be willing to try different things with your partner. We have to do certain things mm -hmm. different too. That comes back with compromising. Yeah, and it right? also so, comes back to not changing the right, person. Right. Yeah. So with that being said, let's say for example, your partner don't like when you leave the plate in the kitchen mm -hmm. after you eat your food and thing, right? You try to compromise and, you know, don't do that. You see me, even if I something you normally do, them small things are things where you can compromise with and change. And this, especially when you're living with the person, right. you have to think about that really hard. Right, right. right and right. The, um, the next point for me, I don't, like, don't just leave up the relationship. All right, then you get the person now, you know, but I want to go away, you know, just in at the house. That is a don't. Right. When you can go out, it don't must be expensive. You can make inexpensive moves. You can go to the beach. You can um, simple things. Simple local simple, things. Simple go down things. town. If you're living in a thing, go to the walk. park. Set up your yeah. little table and thing. Buy a little KFC. Them little small so things. So don't lay out the relationship right. because you're in the relationship now. And right. there is this quote that says, um, She was the person you wanted. That everybody wants, and she's still the person everybody wants after you have her. Right. Something along that line. Right. Yeah. So. Um. The next point is just you know it's very simple. You know it's just be appreciative of every little thing that yeah. a person does. You know, don't look over anything that that person tries to do for you because the moment you do that, then you actually. It's possible that you can break down that person's moral to regarding certain things they normally mm -hmm. do, right? Mm -hmm. So they might feel like they don't want to do that again because it wasn't appreciated. You know, I did it and it wasn't appreciated. So you know, now I do it. So be appreciative of the person. Always try to show that person appreciation as well. Don't just be appreciative, but show them that you appreciate them. You know, small things are what matters. Mm -hmm. And then remember that each person that you meet, they may be coming from a different background, right? Very important. So you cannot say, oh, I am from Portmore. Very important. So you expect me who come from the inner city to adjust accordingly immediately. If you care enough, you're going to show me, you're going to teach me. So I don't, again, is don't expect to so meet somebody and them are go, Everything when you want, it I got in a one person. Some things you have to teach a partner. You have to teach a partner how to love you sometimes. Said, teaching a partner is one, but you have to also be willing to learn. To learn. You have partner. to learn. So it's a vice versa thing. You know, mm -hmm. so everything we said basically ties into just one thing compromise. Compromise. All of that is compromising. compromise. Yeah. And that's it. I, I don't for me in a relationship is disrespect. I don't know how that wasn't the first thing that I said, but I don't for me is disrespect. Don't use no curse words to me and this in this is in a derogatory way. For example, me and my friend here so now I run a job. It is okay for me that say, you know, re, re, re. But if it's something serious like you gotta tell me, um Go wash my bad old, bad old clothes. It's a no for me. Automatically, anytime right. I use disrespectful words to me right. in a certain manner, I'm done with you. I don't care if it's a relationship or whatever, family, friendship. No. I, I am not about the disrespect. So that's a no for me. No, with that being said, um, disrespect comes in different forms. So another don't for me would be like trying to use things from my past. Yeah. To speak about things no. right now mm -hmm. that is geared towards the future. That is a uh, don't. And, and, and like I said this again, don't use things in the past, right, for judge your present no. And don't use things I judge the tell person's you, present don't no. I don't use things on my, yeah. And, and I come, yeah. I tell you some about me as my partner, I don't come use it back against me. me because I didn't have an option for don't tell you. Exactly, and because I can't find you because I trust, trust you, I exactly. love you. Exactly. Me, I share certain things with you. Yeah. So that's a don't. Yeah. That is kind of a waste man, waste girl um, mentality. situation, mentality, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. True, so right. I'm not about that. Right. A don't for me is not popular. 
popping up at a significant other's yard. Yeah, me know, say. We're together, we are together and stuff. But this is not a don't for me because me have something to hide. You get my sense? Right. All, for me, it's about my feelings, and communication. communication, how I'm feeling at the moment. Suppose so, I just feel for chill. All right. Me, I'm angry. People need space. I mean, I'm not pop up on a boy yard because guess what? A girl not chat me up. A girl not acid me. Yeah, but I didn't have, but I didn't have a thing about that. They not pop up because me, you know what? Uh, yeah, it's rude. Yeah, it yeah, is rude. there and the person are different. Fire very different. Yeah, yeah. 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 Simple that. Communication. Simple. Um. Would have to talk about communication in a relationship in a whole well, other different. video because yeah, it man. consists of so many yeah. things and so many. Um, particular, um, just different, com just different components, components yeah. Of, yeah. So, if you want us to speak on um, communication within a relationship, you can comment down below and let us know. We are a professional, but the thing is, we've been in relationships for so long, we know what to expect, what is a red flag. Sometimes, when I see some red flags, I want to observe it. it. That is, again is a whole nother video. We ignore it, man. We ignore yeah. it because you know the type of feelings we have for that person. Mm -hmm. But let me tell you this. Um the thing that separates the slaves from slavery is the courage to offend somebody. Yeah. You think about what other people are gonna think, you think about what other people are gonna say, you think about mm -hmm. the judgment that's gonna be cast on you. So everything fear this pass. You know? One next very important don't is don't take your say and go mash up your relationship. Don't take your say and go mash up your relationship. Right. Go ask your partner and trust me, three quarters of the time we know say a effort them attack, you know. But we still dead it's still a red flag. We we don't observe the red flag. I love what say so it was yeah. So but don't um what's that point? Don't you don't listen to what other people don't listen say. to what other persons say. And I don't again is don't search your partner's cell phone. Men are believing at that. Men are like the idea. Again, not because we have something to hide, but it's I a think my trust. phone is my um, space. Yeah, your personal space. You so know? I don't I don't think that's right for somebody. Maybe else. you don't want to know I mean they can ask. Yeah. You know? If you want to ask and then you want to prove, yeah, sure, I'll mm -hmm. hand you the phone. But and you don't just take up my phone because you have the password and go in it like yeah, that. Yeah, because you feel like we, you feel like saying, me and just stop more. Yeah. And don't judge your partner because them have um, friends from the next gender, a lot of friends from the next gender. Many persons are comfortable with having friends, keeping friends from the next gender. Well, I may have been speaking of that. A long time. My son is 12 now and it has been since my son are like... About about long time from about three, three. Well, in about 2013, long, long time. time. Yeah. So, you have any more don'ts, my friend? Well, I mean, that's it for me. You know, anything else that you know you'd like to hear, or any yeah. other topics that you have for us to speak about, you can just comment down below. We'll be happy to speak on that. Yeah. And if you want to see um any other my friends in the videos. Um, you may have seen them from vlogs. You can also comment down below. I'll try my best to make myself available. And guys, my always, I go have to apologize. I'm so sorry for not posting. I am extremely busy. Um, school work, I'm actually day I work now, school in a bit. But I'm so grateful. Rolling came by, stopped to say hi, and we got the chance and to do this drug video. Me in our video. You know. Because the man have valid points, the man been in relationship and understand life. Yeah. So really and truly, it's just about being around persons right now that make you happy. Protect your mental health. That's very important. Don't make nobody drown out like shoes lace. Not time at all. And live your best life. You happy only me. live once. Just laugh, man. Yeah. Laugh, you know. Try to transform anger into love all the time. I learned that yesterday. That's it. Positive regard. Yeah, man. All the time. Yeah, turning positive, uh, negative all energy into it works positive. All the time. It works yeah. better all the time. Yeah. So thank you guys for watching. I must thank you for being in my video. 
no a big problem. thank you to you. No problem. And if you are still here, you've reached the end of the video. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Turn your post notification on so you'll never miss an upload. And protect your mental health. I'm Bye, time. guys. <laughs>